everyone has an opinion about WordPress, whether they think it's the best or somewhat a dinosaur. You are going to hear multiple point of views. Now while I understand that selecting a website builder is very personal and subjective, there are also objective realities that should be considered. So in this video, we are going to talk about five reasons why you should use WordPress for creating your business website. So if that sounds interesting, then let's dive in. My name is Ankit and you are watching Elegant Themes YouTube channel, the makers of the DV page builder. Now, before we proceed, I would like to mention that all the links, resources and plugins that we are going to use or recommend in this video, we have added the links to all of them in the video description below. So if you want to check out details about any one of them, you can go ahead and check out the link in the video description below. And some of the links might be our affiliate links. So if you use those links to make your purchase, we might earn a little bit of kickback, which is not going to cost you anything extra, but it's definitely going to help us create more helpful and free content just for you. And if you want to read about each and every step that we are going to cover in this video, we have created a complete blog post that you can follow. So if you want to follow along and read the blog post, we are going to leave a link for that in the video description below. Now WordPress remains the single best choice for small business owners and those creating new or smaller website due to its unparalleled flexibility and customizability. Now I'm sure you must have heard this many times, but WordPress key strength is in its vast ecosystem of themes and plugins. Now where themes you can think of as your website overall design and layout, while plugins can add specific functionality to your website. This modular approach allows website owners to start with a basic website and gradually add features in form of plugins as their business grows without needing a complete overhaul. While millions of developers using the platform, there is not a problem that someone hasn't already figured out or either offered a free plugin or theme or provided it for a reasonable price. You simply cannot find that anything else to this same extent as with WordPress. The community drive development ensures that WordPress stays current with web technologies and trends ensuring that you have the access to a future-proof platform. It's so flexible that you can even assemble a small plugin using ChatGPT in a couple of hours. Now, if you are considering SEO or Google search traffic, then you cannot go wrong with WordPress. If you follow some SEO expert on social media, then you quickly find out that they tend to gravitate towards WordPress, not exclusively, but very much primarily. That's because it not only simplifies on-page SEO, but also offers the capabilities for detailed technical SEO, especially when you get developers involved. When you think of SEO on a platform like Wix or Squarespace, each platform gives you one way of performing routine SEO tasks on your website. Now, while this is acceptable for or a beginner or a non-technical person, you get more mileage from WordPress than with these proprietary platforms. With WordPress, you have several options of SEO implementation in form of SEO plugins like Rank Math, Yoast, SEO Framework, SEO Press, and lot more. And all these plugins have free as well as paid version available. And even if we don't consider these third-party SEO plugins, WordPress in itself also got various features for SEO that are inbuilt in the WordPress itself. There are plenty of customization with features like permalinks, link architecture through parent-child relationship, sitemaps, and mobile responsiveness. Now, I'm sure it doesn't sound like a good reason to use WordPress. Community support is definitely a reason to feel at ease with it. You won't find any website builder out there with more Reddit threads, answered Stack Overflow questions, or other free forums for the sole purpose of helping people use WordPress. What's more beside these general WordPress community support, Communities are built around highly used premium products like Divi. Here in Facebook group of Divi, we have 75k plus members to help you get the most out of your favorite solution. And of course, there is nothing like getting a help from your friends. And not just us at Divi, virtually every premium theme or plugin you choose offers plenty of premium support. For instance, Divi offers live chat email support for every Divi member even lifetime members as well. And along with that, Divi also offers super fast support to Divi VIP subscribers who need faster resolutions. Now the WordPress and Divi knowledge these support agents have is out of this world and well worth tapping in. 
Some of you might surprise to find out that WordPress is one of the largest e-commerce solutions. Well, WordPress with free WooCommerce plugin. Now Shopify gets a lot of attention because it only does e-commerce, which simplifies how people think about it. Shopify is equals to e-commerce in everyone's mind. But WordPress is no e-commerce slot and offer plenty of reasons to use it. Now, if you use WordPress with WooCommerce, there also you can manage inventory, process payments, set up shipping options, calculate taxes, handle orders, and even accept donations. And when you use premium themes like Divi with WooCommerce, you can add attractive pages, checkouts, and storefront to the list. <laughs> WordPress is designed to accommodate both small as well as large websites, making it suitable for business at any stage. As your traffic increases from a few hundred visitors to thousands or millions, WordPress can handle this growth without requiring a complete redesign or migrating to a different platform. This flexibility is crucial for business anticipating growth without redoing it with more resources. Now, one of the primary reasons businesses need scalability is to manage increased online traffic effectively. WordPress can support high traffic volume, but its performance is largely dependent on hosting environment. And that's where we always recommend you go with some premium hosting company. And for that, we have a lot of recommendations and SiteGround is top of that. And if you want to learn more about our recommended hosting providers, then make sure you visit elegantthemes.com forward slash hosting for more information. Just like proprietary website builders, hosting company typically offers various tiers to support more of this traffic. This is usually a simple upgrade that can help you scale from a shared managed to a cloud hosting. <laughs> Now, there is a lot of old and misleading information about there concerning WordPress. We will clarify what we can so you can consider it for your projects instead. Many people dismiss WordPress out of hand without knowing it might be optimal solution for their website. So the misconception number one is slow performance. Now this is largely unfounded. Now while it's true that a grossy unoptimized WordPress site can be slow, proper optimization and quality hosting can make WordPress extremely fast. Now, getting hosting from a reputed hosting provider, adding caching plugins like WP Rocket, W3 Total Cache, and using a content delivery network can easily optimize your website for fast speed. Misconception number two, hard to manage. It's true that if you compare WordPress with something like Weebly or Wix, you will find yourself clicking the update button a lot. But this isn't that bad and hardly the full story. A managed WordPress hosting provider like WP Engine or even SiteGround can automatically handle all updates, security and backup for you. You will also find that the freedom WordPress offers you in terms of site building makes the things a lot easier. Whether you want to use WordPress as a classic page editor or something very visually or sophisticated like Divi, you can create the workflow and feel most comfortable with. And this definitely makes things easier, not harder. The next misconception is poor security. Now, if you do not maintain a site properly, then no matter what platform you are using to build your site, it's vulnerable to get hacked. Every platform, including WordPress, is very secure when best practices are followed. In case of WordPress, regular updates to WordPress core, themes and plugins address security vulnerability easily. Security plugins like WordFriends and Security add additional layer to protection on your website. And of course, security is more up to the site owners with WordPress. But that's one small cost associated with all the other benefits of its features and customization. Since it is relatively easy to maintain and secure site, this shouldn't be cause too much concern. Now, the next misconception is really funny. Behind the times. Now, WordPress is over 20 years old, but it does not mean that the code is 20 year old. Every year, WordPress uses more updated version of PHP, JS, jQuery, SQL, and that's just the basis of base programming language used to make WordPress. WordPress itself is being worked by thousands of volunteers every day. With every update, WordPress stays relevant for those who build, manage, market, and provide technical upgrades for WordPress websites. And along with that, WordPress has never been more relevant for those performing technical SEO. And of course, I agree, the admin UI does feel like outdated. But the most important thing are getting better and better. 
Then when you consider some of the most competitive and used plugins and themes that are pushing boundaries themselves, you get a very different picture than those who say WordPress is a dinosaur. If we take a look at Divi AI for example, it offers cutting edge AI website building that rivals or outspace many platforms that are built in the last few years. So how is WordPress compared to other page builders like Wix or Squarespace? WordPress is a powerful and flexible platform compared to Wix, which is user friendly with a drag and drop interface ideal for beginners. Wix offers an easier setup but limited customization with its extensive plugin library provides more advanced features suitable for complex websites. However, Wix can become expensive as you add more features to it. Since most people like how easy Wix is to set up and running, it's worth noting that you can easily have similar experience on WordPress as well. For example, DV features a fantastic onboarding experience that lays all groundwork for your website. An onboarding screen will appear once you purchase Divi and install it on your website. And along with that, using Divi, you can use pre-made starter sites that can help you create any type of website from head to toe in just a few clicks. Now Squarespace is known for its beautiful templates and redefined designs and this appeals to many creatives. While it offers ease of use, it has again fewer customization options as compared to WordPress, which is an open source in nature and plugins provide great flexibility and control over design and functionality. Now since most people are drawn to Squarespace templates and simple design interface, Divi Visual Builder is worth noting. It does everything Squarespace does. And even more than that, and once again, you have a freedom of choosing from thousands of pre-made layouts and this can help you launch your website in just a few clicks in no time. Now Shopify excels in creating and managing online stores with its streamlined user-friendly e-commerce features. On the other hand, using plugins like WooCommerce, WordPress is a versatile and customizable offering range of features and large ecosystem for developers. Now there are two areas where WordPress is absolutely objectively beats out Shopify. Number one, pricing and number two is design ease. And after using both of them, I can tell you that for every website that I have tried creating on Shopify, I always rebuild that with WordPress at a very lesser cost. And if you use Divi to create e-commerce pages using WooCommerce modules, then I'm sure you will never look back. So I hope by now you got a very clear idea about why you should use WordPress for your next website project. So if you found this helpful, then make sure you hit like and share it with your friends and community. And for more videos like this, make sure you subscribe to this channel and hit the notification bell so that you can get notified whenever we upload our next video. That's it for this one and I'll see you in the next video.